What is up guys, my name is Brentai and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you three very simple, very easy flare moves that you can use for flare attending or just showing off to your friends or anything like that. I asked you guys if you wanted to see it and a lot of you said yes. So today I'm going to be using a, uh, a flare bottle, um, which is obviously just a, an empty uh, basic plastic bottle, so if you drop it it doesn't really matter. I'll also be showing you them with uh, an empty glass bottle and a, a bottle with liquid as well, just so to show you it doesn't really make a difference um, whether what type of bottle it is that you want to you want to use, obviously if you can get your hands on one of these, I definitely recommend practicing it with one of these. The amount of times I dropped it when I was learning is a lot. Um, so obviously, if not, have to go glass, but I'd recommend you do it over a rug or a carpet. Something where it's not going to fall and break. Let's get on with the first one. Okay, so the first one is a really, really nice, simple one. Just adds a wee bit of style, a wee bit of class to, to what you're making. If your bottle's on the bar, you just pick it up. It's called the palm spin. Spin the bottle around and pour. Simple as that. Glass bottle and pour. And obviously, if you've got your liquid in, and pour. Really nice and simple. The way you do it is on your hand, you literally just twist it there, and it just pivots on your hand, you grasp your hand again. You're not, not going to be afraid to twist it with your wrist, you just got to throw it around, and pour. Really simple, looks really good when you use it as well. Okay, so the next one, you've got your bottle, it's in your speed rail down here. You're picking up, so as if you're going to pick up a bottle, you um, like that or whatever, like you want to grab it by that, so you want to pick it up, spin it in the air, and pour like that. So you want to catch it, as it's fallen on the way down, as if you're going straight into pour, I'll show you guys again. It's up and pour like that with a glass bottle, bring it up and pouring. Obviously, I'm holding it here as if I have a chrome pourer on it. Um, and for the liquid one as well, it's up and straight pour. It's very important if you're doing it with liquid in it that you've got to catch it right above the glass. Obviously, liquid is going to be coming out as soon as it's turning upside down. So, really simple again with that one. Boom, straight in. Okay, so the last one I'm gonna show you is the behind the back flat toss. Now this um, one can be done with any bottle, even if it's full. Um, the other two I would only recommend doing with a bottle uh, if it's got a wee bit of liquid in it, um, like this one here. Obviously centrifugal force will keep the liquid in the bottle. If it's a lot fuller, it's not any more difficult, it's just that the liquid's gonna come out a lot faster, or it's gonna need a lot more force to keep it in the bottle. Bit of a spin, pushing it with your hands, catching it that way, and pouring from there, so it's like that and down. Okay, so I'll show you from behind, spinning around, pushing it through and up. So when you're coming through, you're pushing with your fingers there, and you're pushing it that way, making sure that the bottle stays flat. Kicking it with your palm there so that actually the top stays flat. So when you're catching it, you're catching it flat like that, and then I'm twisting it in the air and bringing it down. Glass bottle, same again, and down, or one with liquid in it. You're going round, up, and bring it down. Okay, I'll quickly show you one more time, this time with our almost full bottle, coming round, up, and pouring down. So there we go, folks. That is three really nice, easy, simple flare moves you can try at home or practice to show off or impress your friends. If you have enjoyed today's video, make sure you smash the like button if you much and greatly appreciate it. If you guys want to see more of this, make sure you let me know if you want to see more advanced ones or anything along those lines in the comment section down below. Feel free to go check me out on Twitter, Snapchat, and Instagram. Links to them will be in the description down below. Other than that, guys, though, until next time, I've been the Prentai. And I'll see you all soon.